Gavin and Gail West fell in love and married in Cape Town in 1991. Today they are a close-knit family of four who refer to themselves as so-called coloured middle-class South Africans. They have a 19-year-old daughter, Robin, and a 24-year-old son, Jamie. Thank you for the food. Amen. Amen. Like most South Africans, the West family agree that the quality of life in the country has improved since the dawn of democracy, but say there are many challenges still facing so-called coloured people across the country. Gavin is a successful engineer who owns his own company. He's concerned that not enough has been done to create jobs and fight poverty in the past 21 years of South Africa's democracy. My hopes as a parent of a coloured family is not only for my own children, it's for all children out there. My biggest fear is that if there's not enough jobs going around, um, they just become a statistic. And they can go anyway. Crime, drugs, everything is ahead of us here. And um, the problem I have is poverty. If we can eradicate poverty, and then a crime, I believe, will come down. And, um, and I hope that we get there. You know? His wife, Gail, is more concerned about the inequality in South African society. The rainbow nation that we built in 1994 is something that we all aspire to want. But I think it's going to take us much longer and um, we're going to need more patience to get there. I would say even within our colored community, it's not racism, it's class distinction. Um, it is more of what I have and where I live as opposed to who I am and who we are as a community. 21 years later, there is more division amongst us uh, as we see each, each other in certain groupings. And uh, we don't identify ourselves as one South African. <laughs> Racism is rife here, yeah. especially in the, in the colored community. I mean, we discriminate against each other uh, because we see each other differently. I don't get to interact with other races as often. When I do, I don't see colour. I see cultural differences. Um, and that's the barrier. Their daughter, Robin, was born in the new South Africa. She explores race and identity in her artwork trying to find out where so-called coloreds fit into South Africa's rainbow nation. My dreams for South Africa for the future would be that there can be more unity in the races and within our country in accepting other cultures and other nationalities and just say that we're all South African and be united as a people. My hope for my kids first and foremost, is that they live a prosperous life and uh, um, not, as, not go through as many struggles as we did in the past. Renadal Calm, CCTV, Cape Town.